Welcome back, Leia users. In this video tutorial, we're going over how to edit links. Okay, so right off the bat, I'd like to mention that you can turn any element into a link. So we're going to click on this title, and you'll see that's going to bring up this menu, and you have an option to edit that link. And here is where you would insert the link. And let's actually check out this button for more on how linking works. So we're going to go down to edit link and you'll see that I already have a link in here for this for this button. So it says slash new page. A slash will take you to a different page. Um, my page is titled new page and the way this works is this dash takes the place of the space. So it's new dash page in order to get to another page and you'll actually need an upgrade to lay a business if you would like to have multiple pages for your website. All right, another thing you can do seen here, if you want users to be prompted to give a phone call to the number that you punch in, you want to put TL colon and then the number. So whenever a user taps on it or clicks it, the prompt will come up saying, hey, you want me to call this number? You can call that number. Easy way to get a hold of you. Next thing you can do is enter your email address. If you want this uh, button to bring up your user's default mail program, It'll pop up with this mail address in the to section. You'll just type in mail to colon, and you can see here, lay at mail systems. You can do example at email.com. Um, yeah, there you go. Uh, again, if you're going to link to a site outside of your page, you're going to need to make sure you put an HTTPS or an HTTP. Otherwise, it's not going to work. Uh, Google.com. Uh, this is also something you're going to want to make sure to check and make sure you did properly. If you go to your live site, you can click on your page, make sure it links them to the correct link. And then finally, at the bottom, you can see there if you use the pound sign or hashtag and uh, section name, uh, this link will take it to that section. When your user clicks on this button in the header, it will drag them down to the about section or the contact section or whichever section you like to punch in there. All right, that's all for now. Please check out our other tutorials for more on other topics. If you have any further questions, please feel free to send us an email to leah at vibesoftware.com or visit heylea.com slash contact. Thanks for watching.